my beloved child, as I gaze upon you from the heavens above, my heart swells with an immeasurable love that transcends time and space. Today, I wish to speak to you about a matter most precious, the sacred bond between you and your mother. In the tapestry of creation, I have woven a thread so beautiful, so resilient, that it connects two souls in a way that mirrors my own divine love for all my children. Your mother, my cherished daughter, was chosen by me long before the stars found their place in the night sky. I molded her with tender care, imbuing her with qualities that would one day nurture and guide you. In her eyes, I placed the warmth of a thousand suns, so that when she looks upon you, you feel the radiance of unconditional love. In her hands, I bestowed the gentleness of a spring breeze, so that her touch would soothe your troubles and calm your fears. And in her heart, I planted the seeds of unshakable faith and boundless compassion, for I knew she would need these to guide you through life's winding paths. When I first whispered the idea of you into the universe, it was your mother's womb that I chose as the sacred vessel to cradle your forming soul. For nine moons, she carried you beneath her heart, her body becoming a living sanctuary. During those months, as your tiny form took shape, I watched as she spoke to you, sang to you, and dreamed of the joy you would bring. Her every thought, every prayer, was a tender caress upon your nascent spirit. Do you remember, my child, the moment you drew your first breath in this world? I do. It was a symphony of miracles. As you emerged, your mother's pain transformed into a joy so profound that the angels paused in their celestial chorus to witness it. In that instant, when her eyes met yours for the first time, a covenant was sealed, a promise of love that neither time nor trial could ever break. From that day forth, your mother became my emissary of love on earth. Through her, I have held you when you cried, rocked you to sleep with lullabies that echo the harmonies of paradise, and kissed away the tears that fell when you stumbled. When hunger gnawed at your little belly, it was her breast that I filled with nourishment, a pure elixir that sustained not just your body, but your very essence. As you grew, taking those first wobbly steps, uttering those precious first words, it was your mother who was there, her heart bursting with pride. Each milestone you reached was a celebration in the heavens, for I saw in your growth the blossoming of a divine plan. And always, always, your mother was there, her love a constant, her guidance a beacon in the sometimes confusing journey of childhood. There were nights, my child, when your mother knelt by your bedside, her whispered prayers rising like incense to my throne. She beseeched me to watch over you, to shield you from harm, to light your path. Little did she know that her very presence in your life was the answer to those prayers. For in giving you a mother such as her, I bestowed upon you a guardian, a teacher, and a friend whose love rivals even that of my celestial host. Yet, do not think that your mother's role is merely to coddle and protect. No, for in her I have also placed the strength of mountains and the wisdom of ages. When you falter, she will not always rush to catch you. For she understands, as I do, that some falls are necessary for your growth. Instead, uh, she will be there to dust you off, to remind you of your inherent resilience, and to encourage you to try again. Her discipline, born of the deepest love, is my way of teaching you the value of perseverance, integrity, and self-respect. There will be times, my precious one, when the world seems cold and unforgiving, when peers are unkind, when dreams shatter like glass, or when the weight of growing up feels too heavy to bear. In these moments, remember that I have given you a sanctuary in your mother's embrace. Her arms are the branches of the tree of life, ever ready to enfold you. Her words are the echoes of my own voice, reminding you of your divine worth and the strength that lies within. As you journey through adolescence into adulthood, 
Your relationship with your mother will evolve. Like a river finding new paths to the sea, your bond will navigate through rapids of misunderstanding and placid pools of newfound respect. There may be storms, moments when you feel she doesn't understand, when her love feels like constraint, or when the need to forge your own path pulls you away. These times are part of the grand design, my child. For just as a butterfly must struggle to break free from its cocoon, so too must you grapple with independence to truly appreciate the roots from which you've sprung. But know this, no matter how far you roam, no matter how fiercely you assert your autonomy, your mother's love will follow. It will be there in the care packages she sends, in the late night calls she answers without hesitation, in the silent prayers she offers when you face life's battles. And when you return, whether in triumph or in need of solace, she will be there, her love unchanged, her forgiveness as vast as the oceans I have made. In your mother, I have given you a mirror of my own divine nature. When she forgives your transgressions without condition, it is my forgiveness you glimpse. When she loves you despite your flaws, it is my unconditional love you feel. And when she believes in you, even when you've lost faith in yourself, it is my unwavering belief in your potential that shines through. As the years pass and roles shift, you may find yourself caring for her as she once cared for you. Her hair may silver, her steps may slow, but her love will remain aflame undiminished. In these moments, remember that in serving her, you serve me. For I have said, honor your father and mother, not as a commandment to burden you, but as a key to unlocking blessings beyond measure. In your tender care for her, you complete a sacred circle, your love becoming the crown of her life's work. My child, the bond between you and your mother is a testament to my creative power. It is a living paragon of the love I desire to see flourish among all my children. In your joys and sorrows, your agreements and conflicts, your shared laughter and tears, you are painting a masterpiece of human connection that brings glory to my name. So cherish this gift, this mother I have given you. Learn from her, grow with her, and love her with the same ferocity with which she loves you. For in this relationship, I have planted a seed of the divine. Nurture it well and it will grow into a tree whose branches reach into eternity, whose fruits are joy, understanding, and a love that, like mine, knows no bounds. Remember, my beloved child, that in the tapestry of your life, the thread that binds you to your mother is woven with my very essence. It is unbreakable, eternal, and ever-growing in beauty, in loving her, you love a part of me. And in this sacred communion of parent, child, and divine creator, you touch the very heart of existence. Go forth now, with my blessings upon you both. May your days together be a hymn of gratitude. Your challenge is a testament to your shared strength, and your love a light that guides others to my embrace. For you, my child, and the mother who adores you, are the living embodiment of my most wondrous creation, the miracle of love. With endless love and eternal watchfulness, your heavenly Father, dear esteemed benefactor, your unwavering support and super thanks elevate our journey, infusing it with unparalleled significance. We invite you to continue alongside us, enriching each step with your generosity and blessings. Rest easy, my child, for I am vigilantly watching over you under my protective wings. You are safe from harm, my beloved child. Do not fear the terrors of the night, nor the dangers that stalk by day. Do not tremble when troubling news reaches your ears, or dread the illnesses that hide in darkness. I am your guardian around the clock. My love and protection accompany every step you take. Through moments of joy and times of sorrow, from sunrise to sunset. My watchful eyes are fixed on you with love and care. You are never alone on this journey. I will shield you from all harm and watch over your family members, 
They too are covered by my grace, protected from accidents and shielded from danger. I promise my unwavering protection and provision at all times. In joy and sorrow, in triumph and defeat, through calm and storm, I am at your side holding your hand. My provision for you is endless, flowing like a river of blessings over your life and your families. Would you like to lend a helping hand and support our mission? Click below to buy me a coffee and be an integral part of spreading God's message through our YouTube channel. Your contribution means the world to us. Thank you kindly for your support. I will prevent the adversary's attacks from reaching you. Neither misfortune nor scarcity will touch your home. The schemes of the enemy will fail against you. My boundless power will thwart their plots forever. Nothing and no one can snatch you from my grasp. Walk by faith and in me. You will find everything your soul desires in abundance. Persist in my word, for it will illuminate your path in the darkness and keep your foot from stumbling. My word is the lamp that lights your way, the compass that guides you through uncharted territories, revealing profound truths and everlasting principles that lead to peace and wisdom. Just trust in me, for I will always be cradling your heart and guiding your steps. I will prevent any misfortune from befalling you, even as you traverse valleys of shadows and walk paths shrouded in darkness. I will be your protector, so be at peace. Do not fear the evils that may lurk near your home or threaten your well-being, and do not be intimidated by unseen ailments. Remember, in every challenge and hardship, I am with you, providing the strength and security you need to forge ahead. Believe in me, my beloved child. Trust in my word. I will steady your steps so that you may experience my peace and tranquility, a blessing that surpasses all understanding. This peace will fill your being, bringing calm and serenity even amidst life's storms. Remember, no evil or disease will come near you, for my angels encircle you, safeguarding you and your family. My wings of protection will wrap around you with unbreakable strength, and my hands will support you always. So do not fear, for I am your God. Do not dread the terrors of the night or the dangers that stalk during the day. Do not be startled by unsettling news or the illnesses that hide in darkness. I am vigilantly watching over you at all hours. Rest in me, my cherished one. Rely on me and my promises. Let my steadfastness be your anchor in tumultuous times, and my love the refuge for your soul when worries threaten to overwhelm you. Recall that my love is mightier, stronger, and more powerful. Nothing can sever you from my embrace not even the fears that besiege your mind. Those storms may churn the seas within you, in me. You will discover a safe harbor where you can moor your faith. Remember my love and grace are sufficient to guide you to a haven of rest. Therefore, do not be intimidated by the challenges and trials you may encounter. Turn a deaf ear to the enemy when he whispers falsehoods and tries to instill fear in your heart. Focus your gaze upon me. For in my presence, you will find the fortitude to face adversities, the wisdom to distinguish right from wrong, and the resilience to stand firm in advance. I ask that you lend me your ears and heart fully, for these words are crafted for your ultimate good. Remember always that my love for you is ceaseless. I yearn to envelop you in warmth and fill your spirit with divine peace, so that during challenging times, you feel sheltered guided, enriched, and profoundly cherished out of the deep affection I hold for you in my heart. I need to discuss something crucial for your inner healing. Be attentive to my actions, for nothing lies beyond my reach. Over time, as you have gradually come to know me, you've seen and believed that my promises are true and steadfast. They will never falter. Yet, there is an area where failure creeps in, and I highlight it not to discourage you or hear you say you wish to discontinue. I bring this to your attention because by listening and adhering to my guidance, your blessings will grow manifold. Embrace the counsel I am about to impart. Should you wish to unlock the gates of heaven and bridge the gap to the divine and supernatural realms, you must cleanse your heart of all grievances and negativity. While I rejoice in your faith, 
Let not the venom of grumbling weaken your genuine belief. Cast aside negative thoughts and despair, for they tend to expand quietly and might one day diminish your vibrant faith. Refrain from uttering complaints. Distance yourself from those who foster discord, doubts, and discontent. Instead, surround yourself with wise companions. Decide today whether to trust in me and embrace the transformative blessing soon to unfold in your life. I am here to share a heartfelt message with you today. Let go of your complaints and embrace a life led by faith and hope. My child, click on the join button to join us as a cherished member of our community. Reject negativity and you will see your life transformed. Blessings will abound. You will experience provision, freedom, healing, and family harmony. Joy will seep into your soul and happiness will fill your heart. All because you chose to put your trust in me. I love you deeply. My child, hold me close and hand over your doubts and grief. Do not rely solely on your strength. Allow me the chance to bless you and reveal the immense love I have for you. Know this, you are never alone. I know yesterday brought tears due to sudden challenges. Things seemed bleak, and you felt deserted by those you believed cared for you. They turned away when you needed them most. It's okay to feel sad. Your emotions are valid. But remember, your tears have ascended to my throne in heaven, the very place where your future is shaped, where healing occurs, where your troubles are addressed, and where I offer you comfort in your brokenness. Even though those you trusted have departed, I am steadfastly by your side, loving you more each day. Forever live with the assurance that I am here, ready to listen. And through the power of my sacrifice, you have direct access to my heavenly throne. Here, you can bring your concerns to me. I am always ready to listen with patience and love. Just like a true friend, I do not ask you to stop crying. It is better to release the pain burdening your soul so that I can fill you with my peace. Yet, be aware that after your tears, joy will follow, and it will be abundant. The time to bless you has come. You are prepared. You can now appreciate the gifts I provide. Everything you've endured has been preparing you for this moment of blessing. The windows of heaven are poised to open, pouring vast blessings upon you. In the quiet moments, feel my peace. It doesn't matter if others have left, for I am here to embrace and console you. Each day, you grow stronger, knowing me better, seeking my face and my word, which shows your loyalty, wisdom, and intelligence. When you close your eyes today and reflect on my words, you will sense my love wrapping around and healing you. Remember, you are never alone. My presence fills your soul with joy. In the dim moments when shadows stretch and the world seems uncertain, remember, I am with you. I stand beside you not just to support, but to fortify and lead you through every challenge. You are my child, never alone or astray. Amidst the chaos of life, trials may stir forgotten feelings. Yet let this reassure you, I am forever by your side until the end of time. You will encounter hardships, but they have already been conquered. No adversity, be it hunger, poverty, peril, or sickness, can defeat you. Though at times it may feel that all these troubles conspire against you, making you feel lost and doomed. Remember, you know me, and my love is unwavering. Your faith is strong. You continue to believe even when you cannot feel or see me. In the fiercest battles, when you think all is lost, that is when you must walk in faith. Confront the challenges, and you'll see them collapse one by one as you press forward without faltering. Among the countless voices calling out to me, yours is distinct. I hear you even before you speak. The beat of your heart echoes to my throne, and I count every tear you shed. In my embrace, you find peace, your heart slows, and in the quiet dawn, like a river flowing gently. I cherish the whisper of your soft words when you look up with innocent eyes and say, 
Jesus, I trust in you. There is no purer form of worship in all the cosmos. I seek not your material gifts. My love for you isn't swayed by your worldly achievements or accolades. Though I rejoice in your victories, true triumph is when your heart offers me simple, humble praise. If you bring me your songs of gratitude, your morning worship, trust that I will bless you abundantly. I am always near, watching over you as you sleep. Seek me each morning, and I will grasp your hand, cure your ailments, and fill your heart with profound joy, reassuring you of my love. I am your God, your provider. I will never forsake you. Place your trust in me. Rest on my promises. My assistance is ever-present. Through joy and hardship, struggle and ease, you are not alone. I am here to provide for you and your family, to offer the finest divine sustenance made of the richest grains and sweetest honey, born from my supernatural might. My blessings and anointing meet all your needs, heal every sickness. From your first breath drawn in the warmth of your mother's womb, my gaze has been fixed upon you with a clear purpose. From your very inception, I destined you to be a vessel of my will, a beacon of edification and blessing to many. I will shape you to fulfill this great calling. Today, I desire for your soul and mind to be immersed in joy and for your heart to rekindle the passion for serving me. Remember those dreams you once set aside. I am preparing the way for you to embrace them again, to learn, grow, and gain wisdom and strength. Soon, I will entrust you with an important task, and I ask for your obedience. Do not belittle yourself or fall into self-judgment. Know that I do not deal in punishment but in encouragement. In the days to come, I will show you how truly valuable you are to me. Continue to strive for what you love, regardless of your age or circumstances. Remember, the power and glory are mine, and I choose to shower you with my spirit of love, triumph, and victory. Hold these words close to your heart for times when you feel weak or face towering obstacles that seem insurmountable. Always remember, I am here to bolster and invigorate you, to lift you to heights where worldly pains and sorrows cannot reach. Be encouraged and rise, for I am commanding you. Feel the fire of my Holy Spirit within you. Conversing with me brings healing. Spending time in my presence offers your soul solace and strength. In moments of tension, when peace seems fleeting and despair looms, turn to me. Stop what you are doing and devote your time to me. In exchange for your trust and faith, I will multiply what you offer manifold. A minute spent with me will yield years of life. A sigh will bring health and joy. And for every heartfelt emotion you share, I will enrich you with love, understanding, and support. Negativity will dissipate the ungrateful will depart. Those who have caused you pain will seek forgiveness. And if they do not return, I will bring others into your life who will value and cherish you. You will thrive, your heart will be content. Every barren tree will blossom, and your home will overflow with blessings. You will witness the power of my supernatural presence. What I offer you is eternal love and joy, treasures that cannot be taken from you. My truth and my word are everlasting and what is born of my spirit remains indelibly yours. This joy I instill in your heart surpasses all earthly riches. Live always with trust in me. Do not be dismayed by a challenging day. For with each new dawn, my eternal happiness returns to you. It is my spirit that will embrace you, my love that will uplift you, providing encouragement and joy to your soul. I want you to understand something deep within your heart and share it with those who doubt you. You are my beloved child, and my supernatural power accompanies you. If anyone needs a miracle, lead them to place their trust in me. The joy I bestow upon you is unbreakable and everlasting. It flourishes in deserts, shines through storms, fills your heart during harsh battles, and sustains you even when you feel drained by life's demands. When sorrow seeks to engulf you, remember, the choice to cling to this promise is yours. This profound joy hinges on your faith and decisions, not on the actions of others. 
Every morning, this sacred and radiant joy greets you, awakening you with a gentle kiss to a day filled with promise. It is my majestic presence. Be still now, for I hear and understand your heart. Never wander away from this love that breathes life into you. Always remember your Heavenly Father who adores you and eagerly awaits to see you at daybreak. In both good and challenging times, hold on to this truth. I am deeply loved by my powerful and loving God forever. Your faith may be tested, your soul fortified, your spirit saturated with my divine essence. You are primed for new wonders. No obstacle can halt your progress. Every prudent step you take is chronicled in the Book of Life. Let go of the notions of failure and abandonment that others have taught you. You were not born with a mind burdened by fear. You are immensely loved and invaluable to me. How could I forsake you when I have crafted blessings just for you? No adversary has the power to persuade me to abandon or forsake you. Even if doubts whisper within your heart, my love remains steadfast and no one can strip it away. So why persist in suffering? Do not let uncertainties wound you without giving me a chance. Despair may ravage your future, life, and family. Consider those you cherish, but also value yourself. Recognize your true worth and heed my words spoken plainly so you can easily grasp and accept them. I will never cease to demonstrate my love for you, even if you turn away. I will persistently pursue you until my spirit eradicates all pain and anyone causing you distress. I will always stand by you. And even in your darkest moments, I will not depart. I love you and will raise you from loneliness. You will not perish. You will thrive. Your troubles will transform into blessings, wisdom, and strength. Just give me a chance. Believe in me. I will envelop you, your soul, your heart, and your family in my tender love. I have observed your heart and am touched by your steadfast faith despite suffering. You remained composed, ignored malicious talk, and resisted their assaults. Therefore, I declare it is time to ascend. In the days ahead, I will unveil a plan for you. You were a blessing to those who underestimated you. They had the chance to cherish you but opted to belittle you. A time of repentance approaches for them, but for you, I will elevate you to new heights among people who respect and appreciate you. The forthcoming months will improve, but do not revert to old paths. Those who once harmed you may try again to pull you into a realm of anguish and despair, but I refuse to let you feel forsaken again. My desire is for you to be filled with peace and assured of my love because I dearly love you, and you have always known this even through the darkest nights. Your faith upheld you. Many mornings found you awake pondering many things. But as dawn broke, you felt my divine mercy anew. Perhaps those who do not care for you will return to challenge you. But remain in my presence daily and immerse yourself in my word. Delight in the sweetness of heavenly honey. My arms will support you. You will not stumble. You will not be overcome. Day and night, in heat or cold, my wings will shelter you. My love will forever be with you. I am your God, your Father, your friend, your companion. And I love you deeply. Sit beside me. Speak freely. Share your heart's desires. And be amazed by my responses. This is the truth I impart to you. Place your complete faith and trust in me if you yearn to witness my power. When you come to me in prayer, Trust wholly that I will respond. There are many aspirations I have sown within you. Some are slowly budding, fueling your desire to rise and achieve greatness. It is vital for you to deepen your understanding of me. Know that I love you as a true and divine Father, and it is my deepest wish for you to thrive. When you ask for blessings, that is precisely what I will grant. Do not wallow in self-pity. I will bless you right where you are, in your current place. I will cause you to prosper. I will enhance your talents and increase manifold. There's no need for anxiety, thinking that success lies far from home. With patience and by focusing on my words, 
delving into my proverbs and finding joy in my psalms, your thoughts will become steady and wisdom will be yours. Understand that it is not my desire for you to roam aimlessly or to struggle for sustenance. I am your provider and will ensure your prosperity. I'm not speaking of fleeting wealth like lavish jewels or costly attire, but of a prosperity that brings true happiness to your family. A prosperity where they can enjoy their bread in peace without fear of adversity. Enjoying health and harmony, well prepared for challenging times. I know you grasp the essence of my message. I send it to you as you fret about worldly matters. This is my guidance to you. Do not forsake your current commitments or abandon your studies. Tend to your job with diligence. Let no one provoke you into leaving your duties and your family to seek fortune elsewhere. If you trust in me, remain steadfast. Listen to my word. Await my signal, and I will lead you. Fear not, for I am with you. I will not let go of your hand even in times of hardship. Be assured that I will perform a great miracle within you. There is a reward for your endurance. A special blessing reserved for your patience. Come into my embrace today and reignite your zest for life. Rise fortified, ready to savor the good things that are on their way. I am eager to instill new dreams within you, to remove those who have caused you pain, and to open your heart to love anew. I will place kind souls in your path who will value you and offer true friendship. Joy is about to enter your life. The agony you've endured is now behind you. Forgive. Let go and cease dwelling on the past. Your blessings are not tied to the mistaken paths you've left behind. Do not seek out those who have wronged and betrayed you. Open your heart fully to the fresh plan I have laid out for you and believe without a doubt that I love you and that I will bless and prosper you because I have the power and the will to do so. I want to see you happy, vibrant, prosperous, and healthy. You have been steadfast through trials demonstrating your dedication and loyalty to me. I began a work in you, and I will complete it despite any obstacles or errors. I will take care of your adversaries and clear your path, but do not yield to menacing threats. Fear not those who seem powerful. I revel in demonstrating my love and power to you daily, and I will astonish you by unlocking doors to incredible opportunities, breaking the chains that bind you, silencing deceitful voices, and removing the insincere from your life. Be attentive to the wonders I will perform in you. Look forward with enthusiasm and unwavering faith. Remember these words well, write them down. Rise each day filled with faith. I know you trust me, but I wish to hear you proclaim it. Declare now with all the might of your soul. Write it with your own hand. My God, I believe in you. I trust you. Here I am prepared to engage in a serious conversation with you. Listen intently to the end. Spare a few moments now and set aside what you are doing. This time you devote to me will be the most crucial of your day, and the words you absorb will shape your life and that of your family. Every morning I arrive to elevate your spirit, to breathe into you the strength and encouragement you need. As you step out of your home each day, without fail, I whisper of my love, and slowly you've come to realize how precious you and your family are to me. In recent months, your faith has brought me immense joy. You've recognized that even though I fortified you, your need is still great. The work I'm doing in your life is ongoing. It cannot be completed in a day, nor can it be finished without involving your family. I understand that sometimes your children seem distant when you talk to them about me. They appear indifferent reluctant to listen. This saddens me a little. I fondly remember their younger days, how they sang praises and brought joy to my heart. Yet, I have a plan for them, and I will continually remind you that you play a crucial role in this plan. I ask that you speak to them gently, avoiding judgment or harsh words, and refrain from punishing them harshly for their mistakes. Remember, words can cut deeply like swords, Learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, even when it's challenging. Set aside any irritation or anger. Approach them with patience and love. They are your family, your flesh and blood, and you are the reason they are here. Do 
Do you see now why I need you? Through you. I want to show your family that I can perform great miracles and that I cherish your children and everyone in your home. Even those not related by blood but whom you love just the same. I desire for your entire family to come into my presence, to hear my word daily. You pray for them and seek prayers for them. If you don't see immediate results, do not be discouraged. Continue to pray persistently, tirelessly, and the time will come. They will alter their perspectives. Seek me anew, and your whole family will be filled with joy. Try once more. Stand with faith. It doesn't matter if you've stumbled, only your foes wish to see you fall. But it is my will for you to rise. Things will shift soon. Do not lose heart over the situations you witness. My power is revealed through a stance of strength. You may feel fear or harbor doubts, but it's your attitude that truly matters. Demonstrate your faith. Walk with confidence. Keep your spine straight. Never wear a look of defeat. Show the world the strength I've given you. Come. Give me a few minutes alone in your room with the doors closed. Here, in the quiet of your solitude, we will start the battle against your adversaries. It is in this private space that we prepare. But your victory will be declared openly, witnessed by all those who once doubted you. You have not been defeated. Your work must continue. Keep planting seeds. Keep fighting for what you dream of, what was taken from you by the enemy. I will restore manifold the garments of shame you were forced to wear, will be replaced with robes of royalty, displayed for all to see. You have grown wiser today, and your faith has deepened. You've learned from past errors, and are determined not to repeat them. Your dreams are precious, do not abandon them. If you surrender, your dreams will pass to another. Someone who dares to fight for them. I know of your love for me and your willingness to follow my lead. But remember always from where your strength originates. Without this remembrance, you risk losing your way. Let my words always be before you. Visible in your thoughts and etched in your heart. Treasure my commandments like the finest gold. Keep striving. Keep trying. Never give up until the day I place a crown upon your head. Lay my hand on your shoulder, and with joy and authority declare, Well done, my child at faithful servant. In times of struggle and pain, you served me bravely without excuses. Even in scarcity, you persevered without doubting. Now, step into the celebration of your victory, in the joy of your Lord. You were faithful in little, now a greater blessing awaits you. That day will surely come. But until then, continue to strive and fight. I understand the reasons behind my actions and the miracle. I promised I will arrive in my perfect timing. Be still and trust every word I say. If you let anxiety overcome you again, it will only wound you, leaving scars on your soul and mind that are hard to heal. That's why I come to bring clarity, to take your heart in my hands and transform your thinking. Reflect on these words. Listen closely. Read them twice. I am aware of what I am doing. And you know of my love for you. Everything unfolding around you is for your benefit. Even if it might feel painful momentarily, understand that it's done out of love. I don't want to see you sad. I long for you to experience that profound joy and zest for life once again. And trust me with all your faith. Allow me to complete the work I've begun in your soul. You will be immensely grateful and realize how I have blessed you. I have chosen to elevate you to use you so that many others might find true joy and prosperity. Thus, in your mind, let there be no space for doubt or complaints. Progress falters without belief. Prosperity wanes when you doubt my promises. You do not navigate this life based on what you see. You walk by faith. You do not falter at obstacles. Even when doors seem shut and iron walls block your path, you press on, knowing these barriers will crumble. You are following my guidance, overcoming adversities, and victory lies ahead. Pay close attention. Your faith in me can move mountains. Your trust in my word can perform miracles. 
Believing in me is rooted in reality. I am your path and your life. My presence in you is tangible. I am your almighty God, empowering you to conquer foes, shift mountains, heal the sick, and break every curse that burdens you. Your faith is the key to your victory. This is not the time for doubt. The moment to relish your triumph is near. But for now, seek solitude with me. Wait with the peace and patience I provide. My promise to you is irrevocable. Sealed in blood and love, heaven and earth may vanish, but my words will endure forever. Embrace my love warmly. Accept my will with an open heart. I cherish you deeply. I know there are times when desperation overwhelms you and patience seems to escape you. I understand and do not judge. My love envelops you even when it feels distant. Life's pressures are many and feeling stressed is natural. I'd rather you speak openly with me about your struggles than bottle up your anxiety. Wrestling alone with burdens too heavy to bear, you know you can't do this on your own. Allow me to assist you. Take time to rest in my presence. You need it. Do it today. Let me be your refuge as I clear the way ahead. There's no shame in admitting your shortcomings. Here in my presence, you are loved, heard, and respected without reservation. Hear my words. Read them carefully. I am speaking gently, inviting you to lean on me, to find peace and security in my embrace. After all, who loves you more than I do? Who visited you this morning with promises of affection? Who awakened you with words of enduring love? I love you immensely beyond understanding. Don't try to rationalize it. Close your eyes, be still, and feel my overwhelming love filling every crevice of your heart. If there's room in your heart still occupied by those who've let you down, let me help you release that space. No one should occupy the place in your life meant for me. If you prioritize me, you will live assured that I am the only one who will never disappoint you. Even if you stumble, even when you feel weak, always remember I will never withhold my grace, my forgiveness, or my help. I delight in blessing you, in loving you, I am here to care for you. Understand this clearly. Even those closest to you can let you down. People may fail despite your high expectations and trust. My love, however, is steadfast, pure, and true. Today, I offer this love to you anew. Believe in it. Even if past hurts have made you skeptical of such profound love. Yet, I will persist tirelessly, waking you each day, speaking to you with affection, transforming your life with my enduring love. In the hustle and chaos that fill your days, amidst the challenges that test your spirit, remember this, I am right here with you. My love for you is boundless and eternal, pure and unwavering. It seeks only your highest good, and because of this love, I assure you I will not fail you. I will uphold every promise I have made to you, ceaselessly working until your life overflows with blessings. From the moment of your creation, I have cradled you in my embrace, accompanying you through each phase of your journey. I have shared in your joys and felt the sting of your sorrows. My love for you has not faltered for even a second, even when others turned away, leaving you hurt and disheartened. I remained steadfast by your side, raising you up, infusing you with courage. I have never abandoned you. Today, dear one, I invite you to find shelter in me amidst the storms, to draw strength from me when you feel frail. Let me guide you along paths filled with hope, peace, and joy. In times when despair grips you, when it feels like the world stands against you, remember, I am forever at your side. No challenge too great, no betrayal too deep, no door too firmly shut can diminish my unending love for you. My commitment to you is limitless. You will never face your trials alone. When you feel lost, seek within your heart. You will find my love kindled there, a beacon in the darkest nights, a guiding light through the deepest shadows. No matter how bleak the road ahead may seem, 
I will always illuminate your path and bolster your spirit. Even surrounded by those who let you down, know that I remain with you in your loneliest hours. I will envelop you in my comforting embrace. People may disappoint you, but I will forever be your steadfast rock, your protective fortress, or your safe haven. Understand, my child, that in this flawed world, hardships are inevitable. There will be times when solitude and despair feel overwhelming. But always remember, I am with you. My love is a constant presence, and I am always ready to listen and respond when you call out to me. I am here to support you when your strength fades and your hope dwindles. Do not fear weakness, for in your weakest moments, I will fill you with my strength. Never forget that my love has the power to heal all wounds. Place your trust in me and watch as I elevate you. I will reveal the path that leads to triumph and renewal. Even when you find yourself judged or cast aside by others, know that I hold no such judgment against you. My love is boundless and given without condition. Regardless of the missteps you may take or the frailties you might exhibit, I am here to forgive and extend to you a fresh start through my grace, no matter the distance you feel from me. Remember, I'm always right beside you, in me. You can find a safe haven and the comforting embrace of my love. Understand, nothing you do can diminish my love for you. It is a gift of grace freely bestowed, and today I offer it to you wholly and without hesitation. My child, uh, all I ask is that you trust in me, do not turn away from me, and believe in the assurances I give you today. Resist the urge to be swayed by fleeting emotions, for the heart can be misleading. Who better to understand it than I, your Creator? Trust in me, my child, even through the darkest episodes of your life. When it seems like the world is crumbling around you, or when you're caught in fierce storms. Remember, I am the God who quiets the tempests and supports the downtrodden. My power surpasses any challenge you encounter, and my love is stronger than any anguish you endure. Do not be afraid, for I am constantly with you. Hand over your worries and burdens to me, and watch as I transform them into blessings. I am your devoted shepherd, watching over his flock, ensuring that none are led astray. Though your circumstances might lead to doubt, maintain your trust in me and in the flawless design I have for your life. Dear child, my affection for you transcends mere words. My love is more profound than you could possibly fathom. No matter how often you stumble, I will be there to raise you. No matter the frequency of your errors, my grace will always suffice. Place your faith in me. Lay your troubles at my feet and proceed with the assurance that my love is steadfast and true. No matter the circumstances, I am forever by your side. Before you surrender to sleep tonight, pause to hear my voice in the quiet of the evening. Let my words fill your heart. They flow from me like a river of love. Tonight, I want to reassure you of my enduring affection, to remind you that I will never depart from your side. I am with you from the break of dawn to the fall of dusk, watching over your joys and your trials, your achievements and your struggles. Every heartbeat of yours resonates within me, for you are the pinnacle of my creation, fashioned with immense love and care, shaped by my very hands. On this cool evening, I want you to feel my presence, for I have been with you, guarding each step of your journey. Today, I understand it hasn't been an easy day for you. You've faced unexpected challenges, dealt with problems that brought anxiety, stress, and frustration. I see how these burdens have weighed heavily on you, how they sapped your energy. You feel overwhelmed by the multitude of tasks. I know you are weary, my child, that's why tonight I open my arms to you. Come, rest in my embrace, let my presence envelop you bringing tranquility and restoring your vitality. Entrust me with all your concerns and worries. My light will brighten every hidden crevice of your soul, chasing away shadows of doubt and fear. Instead, I will fill you with a sense of achievement and satisfaction. 
recognizing your efforts to surmount the day's challenges. Remember, though storms may roar and winds might howl, I am your sanctuary, a safe refuge where you can always find comfort and strength. Should tomorrow bring more hurdle, more conflicts, and trials, do not be afraid, for I will be there to guide you. I will be the compass that directs your every step. My light will continually scatter the darkness that may lie on your path. Trust in me, my child, and draw near. If worries or fears arise, hand them over to me. Give me all your burdens and concerns, lay your desires at my feet, and I will grant the rest that both your body and spirit crave. In my arms, you will discover the peace and calm you seek. I assure you, on this chilly, dark night, I will watch over you and your loved ones. My loving hands will protect your dreams, shield you with my cloak of protection, and banish any specter of fear or harm. While you rest, I will continue to safeguard your welfare, crafting dreams filled with hope and new beginnings. Tonight, while the world around you sleeps, I will keep vigil over you, like a shepherd tends his flock. My caring hand will defend you from any disturbance that might disrupt your peace. For you are my cherished child, and my deepest wish is for you to live the abundant life I have planned for you. Before you sleep, let go of any bitterness in your heart, and forgive those who have wronged you. Remember, forgiveness is a powerful gift that you can offer both to yourself and others. Let the grace of forgiveness liberate you from the weight of resentment and enable you to rest peacefully. Rest now in my boundless love, dear child. Rest as a child would in the protective arms of their loving father. Let my words tonight soothe your weary soul, and may you awaken refreshed and invigorated, your heart brimming with anticipation, eager to embrace the new day that I have crafted for you. When dawn breaks tomorrow, I will be there beside you, illuminating your existence with the light of my word, rejuvenating your strength, and infusing you with hope. Each heartbeat will remind you of my love, and every step you take will confirm my presence, guiding you with my grace and wisdom as you walk through life. Do so with love, kindness, and compassion, treating everyone with dignity. For these virtues reflect my unending love for all humanity. Trust in me. My child, be assured that I will always be with you. Feel secure, for tomorrow I will direct your steps, light your path, and support you continuously. I will never depart from you, I will be there, attuned to your deepest thoughts, offering you support with love and gentleness. My daughter, do not fear the future or let your heart be troubled by the challenges you face for I am with you. I will neither abandon you nor forsake you. I will shield you from all harm, enabling you to persevere and overcome the burdens that weigh you down. I encourage you to be strong and brave. Do not allow this trying time to conquer you, for the era of miracles continues. It surrounds us even now. You need only place your full trust in me. Believe in my promises, and I will enact a profound miracle in your life. You may feel despondent, your heart heavy with the burden of grim news, fatigued by disheartening prognoses that disturb your spirit. You are tired of what science or others prognosticate about your condition. Yet let me reassure you, your story is far from over. Regardless of how dire or bleak your circumstances appear, I am capable of performing great and wondrous deeds in your life. I can heal you. I can deliver you from this crisis. Just trust in me and hold fast to my word, for it is the salve for your ailments and a source of vitality for your spirit. Dear daughter, understand that it is my will to heal you, to grant you physical healing, and to restore your soul. My deepest desire is for you to enjoy life abundantly, to fully experience my goodness and the riches of my grace. So, beloved daughter, rise and cease your weeping. No longer be saddened. End your suffering, for I, your God, am always with you. And it is my wish that you never doubt this, not even for a moment. 
Know that I am a healing God, attentive to the cries of my children. Simply bring before me your afflictions. I will then remove your ailments and restore your health. I will provide you with divine healing and the renewal your soul requires, empowering you to move forward once more. I ask you to place your trust fully in me and hold fast to my words. Let them heal your wounds and rejuvenate your spirit, flowing like a never-ending spring. Before you seek refuge in me, and I promise you will be safe. No illness or affliction shall prevail against you, for I am your healer. The one who mends your afflictions, lifts your life from despair, and blesses you abundantly. Believe in my promises and endure through these trying times. I will never leave you nor forsake you. Continue moving forward, never losing faith or straying from my path, for there is nothing beyond my restoration. No concern, worry, or sickness can match my greatness. Nothing you face can hinder me from manifesting a remarkable miracle in your life. You need only to believe and trust in my word, and all will indeed be well. Do not fret over how things will unfold, my daughter. Avoid impatience and do not try to hasten the miracle I am preparing for you. Simply trust. Trust in my love for you and allow me to enact my will in your life. Open your heart to the realm of the impossible and watch what I can accomplish when you trust in me. Always remember, you are not alone. I am with you. Holding your hand, guiding you towards your miracle. I will make possible what seems impossible to man and science. Just place your trust in me and I will heal all your ailments. Gather your strength, rise up, and persist. Continue moving forward. Fight for your faith, and you will receive all that you have prayed for. I do not want you to feel discouraged or to lose hope. Do not let fear or doubt deter you. Trust in me, and I assure you a mighty miracle will occur in your life. Be strong and courageous. Do not be fearful or disheartened, for I am committed to fulfilling the work I have started in you. I will do something grand and extraordinary in your life, enabling you to accomplish your goals and receive blessings beyond your imagination. Never cease trusting in me, beloved daughter. Remain steadfast in your faith and continue progressing towards the miracle you most desire. Remember, nothing is impossible for me, and what I promise I deliver. Therefore, keep advancing, daughter, and never forget that the era of miracles is not yet past. I am still performing wonders and miracles today, turning impossible situations into testimonies of my love and power. I will guide you out of your troubles. I will meet your needs. My child, I speak to you with love and understanding during this challenging time you face. Take my hand. Let me lead you from your troubles. I am here to hear your voice and answer your prayers. Your prayers have reached my ears, and I am actively working to resolve your problems and to provide for all your needs. I understand that the road of life often presents formidable challenges. Remember, you are never alone in your journey. I am here, offering my hand to support you through the storm and guide you towards the peace and clarity you desire. Let me be your sanctuary in times of distress, your beacon in the darkness, and your strength in moments of weakness. When the weight of your worries feels unbearable, know that you can relinquish them at my feet. I am here to lighten your burden and rejuvenate your spirit. Do not hesitate to share your fears and anxieties with me, for in my love, you will discover solace and hope. Trust that every step you take towards me in faith brings you closer to the tranquility and freedom you seek. The choices you've made in the past, no matter their nature, do not define your ultimate destiny. In my boundless mercy, I offer you forgiveness and a chance to begin anew. Embrace the grace I provide and allow my power to transform. Warm your heart and mind. Cast aside the burdens of remorse and guilt and accept the liberation that comes from making peace with me and with yourself. As you delve into the depths of my love, you will gain the strength to forgive yourself and others. The compassion and understanding that emanate from me will surround you, 
healing the scars of your soul and restoring your inner peace. You need only trust in me and the restorative process I have for you to refresh your spirit and transform your life. My son, amid uncertainty and adversity, maintain your faith in me and in my ability to perform miracles in your life. Do not be disheartened by the hurdles you encounter, for each challenge presents a chance to grow and become stronger. These trials draw you nearer to the purpose for which you were created. Remember, every hardship, no matter how severe, serves a role in my divine plan for you. Through your struggles, I am shaping your character and crafting your spirit to reflect my light and love to the world. Believe that every tear you shed plants a seed of transformation, and every pang of pain is a chance to expand in compassion and wisdom. Never fear seeking assistance when needed, for I have placed loved ones, faithful souls, and wise individuals in your life to support you on your path. Open your heart and mind. Do not ignore the guidance I provide through them. I am with you in every heartbeat and every breath you take. It is I who will guide and comfort you amid trials. I will safeguard you when the storms rage fiercely. So, when you encounter moments of difficulty and trial, remember, you are enveloped in my unconditional love and restorative grace. Trust that I am actively working in your life, guiding you towards fulfillment and enlightenment. I will never abandon you. Let my light illuminate your path and my love rejuvenate your soul. With each step you take towards me, you will find comfort, strength, and hope to persevere. Remember, my son, you are cherished immeasurably, and your life holds a divine, unique, and special purpose, one that only you can fulfill. Therefore, believe that every step towards me brings you nearer to your blessings. You must remain strong and courageous, beloved son. Do not view your circumstances as barriers or weaknesses. See yourself as I see you, more than a conqueror. You are my son, a valiant man created in my image and likeness. Within you dwells my divine power, which equips you to surmount any obstacle and conquer any adversity. My son, embrace these words. Let my love envelop and sustain you in this time of need. May my peace, which transcends all understanding, fill your heart and mind. Walk in the assurance that my power exceeds any challenge you may face. Today, my son, on this glorious morning, receive my love, grace, and blessings. Embrace this day knowing you carry my light within you and my love as your protective shield, my beloved child. Always bear in mind that I love you, and you are never alone on this journey. With me by your side, no one and nothing can harm you. Place your trust in me, and you will see that everything, absolutely everything, will turn out well for you. Hear my words to you. Nothing is beyond redemption. I still hold grand promises for your life. I am aware of each tear you shed. They are all counted before me. There is nothing about you that I do not know. Every moment of your existence is visible to me, for I have never departed from you. I have always been at your side, ready to assist and console you. My purpose has always been to mend your wounds and rejuvenate your spirit. Yet, your reluctance to heed my words led you astray. And now, you live with regrets from past choices. I know this isn't your finest hour, and you are weary from the constant barrage of troubling news. You feel as if the tragedies in your life are mounting with each passing day leaving you uncertain about when your suffering will end. Yet, remember, I am here for you. Today, I wish to heal you, restore you, and bestow upon you my great blessings. Come now, do not be obstinate. Listen to my voice and heed my words. Cease your tears and complaints about things beyond your control. Listen to me and follow my lead. Return to the path that leads to your salvation to the place where peace and joy await you. I am right here beside you, waiting, unwilling to take no for an answer. You know I will continually offer you my pure and sincere love. 
and nothing you have done or will do can make me cease loving you or turn away from you. So, do not doubt what I say to you today. My love for you extends beyond what your eyes can perceive. Understand that I do not judge you, nor will I judge you for your past. I desire to heal all your wounds and use your life for my purposes. In me, you can walk in blessings and prosperity, achieve your dreams and goals, and live a life full and abundant. For this is my will for you, always. So, do not be misled or think that I am not with you, even if you cannot see or feel me. I am always there, ready to assist, comfort, and bless you. Know that I will never contradict what I have promised you. I will always seek your best interest so that you can accomplish all that you set out to do. Banish negative thoughts from your mind. Cast away doubt and keep away from sin. Eliminate everything that limits the potential I have placed within you. These things only bring destruction, worry, and fear into your heart. Do not let the voice of the enemy consume your life. Do not let hurtful comments wound or harm you. Bring all your troubles to the altar. Surrender your life and cry out to me in prayer. Lay all your burdens and anxieties at my feet, and I will redirect your life. Your destiny will be one of success, not failure because in me, you will discover the true purpose of your existence, the place where you will find peace, joy, and happiness. Remember, I am your God and Father, the one who rewards the obedience and bravery of his children. Therefore, do not disregard what I tell you today. Understand that I have called you to be blessed and that all the blessings I have in heaven, I will bestow upon you on earth. Whatever you have dreamed of, whatever you have prayed for, I will grant you. No obstacle or problem will prevent my blessings in your life. It's time to confront your fears. Pause your life for a moment and set aside all the troubles that have burdened you. Put them aside. Close your eyes and cry out to me. I will respond to all your needs. Remember, I am always with you and there is nothing you can do to make me stop loving you. So do not give up. Take a step of faith and grasp my hand. Let me guide you on paths of blessings where you can accomplish all that you aim to achieve and where things you never imagined possible will become reality. Remember, the righteous are rewarded with all kinds of blessings. So, my son, my daughter, just believe and seek me in prayer. Seek me always and with all your heart. Keep my commandments, and then I will work within you, for I honor those who honor me. Continue moving forward without growing weary. My child, be confident that you will lack nothing because I will fulfill my promise to bless you abundantly. Give me your attention. I want you to listen to my words tonight. I am the way, the, the truth, and the life. What your heart seeks is found in me. Do not waste any more time. Do not heed the world's distractions. Follow my teachings, delve into the scriptures, raise the sword of faith, and don yourself in my armor. You deserve happiness. You deserve a life filled with joy and prosperity. I have seen the pain you carry, and I understand. You trusted blindly and were betrayed. They turned their backs on you. But today, I extend my hand to you. I want you to hear this message of salvation I have for your life. The path of the righteous is challenging, but I am present in every step. No righteous person is forsaken, nor do their descendants beg for bread. Your soul is nourished and rejuvenated each time you hear my voice. Your spirit is revitalized by the waters of my spring. I lift you from despondency and despair, trials, struggles, and pain can weigh heavily, but in the light of my word, you will always find freedom. You need not carry your burdens alone. Let me bear what weighs upon your shoulders. I did not create you to live in suffering. I did not call you to be a child of sorrow. The obstacles in your path are lessons that will make you wiser. Embrace each challenge as an opportunity to grow in prudence. 
You can view your problems as lessons or as defeats. Focus on following the guidance of my word. Study Proverbs within my holy scriptures, and you will find what you seek. I want these words to resonate deeply within your heart. Hear me once more with all the love I have. I did not create you to endure suffering. I did not call you to live in constant lament. You are my child. In you, I have instilled a resilient spirit. Entrust your heart to me. Do not stray from my path, for the allure of the world is strong and its roads are perilous. In this world, there will be those who seek to lead you astray. The evil one will use others to rob you of your blessings and peace. Hold fast to my words, treasure them, and recall them whenever you feel lost. You will stand like a beacon in the darkest night, offering peace and comfort to those in need. Your commitment will not go unrewarded. I will unlock the heavens, showering blessings upon you and your family. Greater and more glorious things are destined for you, revealed when least expected. Your household and you are safeguarded. Believe in my assurances, they are the truth. The difficult days are past, your transgressions are forgiven. You approached me with a repentant and resolved heart. I am renewing you completely, rejuvenating you from the core. I reach out to you now, granting eternal salvation. Your name is inscribed in the book of life, and nothing can impede your progress. If you open your heart to me fully, you will be transformed anew. Declare your belief in my words. The mistakes of the past are behind you now. A new path of transformation lies before you. Tread it with faith and conviction. Do not stumble over the same obstacles. You are wise and discerning. You are not the person who once sinned. I am clothing you anew in garments pure and spotless. Now stand up and set aside your current pursuits. Close your eyes and listen intently. You are strong, courageous, and valuable. At this very moment, I place victory in your grasp. Embrace this promise I instill in you now. Do not disregard it. Believe with all your heart and all your might. Just as the Father celebrated the return of his prodigal son with a feast, so too do I rejoice in heaven when you choose to believe in me. Turn away from worldly temptations and close your ears to those who entice you toward wrongdoing. I do not wish to see you in pain or distress. Allow me to reside within you. Let me make a home in your heart. I will fill the emptiness you feel. Heed my words and follow my commands faithfully. Amen. In the name of Jesus, I decree that no malevolent or adverse force shall prevail against you, your well-being, your temporal affairs, your finances, or your kin. If you find yourself ensconced in bed amidst the disarray, questioning the prospects of amelioration, take solace in this missive. The Divine Orchestrator has everything meticulously orchestrated and is currently forging a bespoke path solely for you. Your dialogues with the Divine have been duly noted. Should it be ordained by Divine Providence, it shall come to fruition impervious to obstruction. In the event of it eluding fruition, rest assured that the Divine harbors even greater designs for your benefit. Find solace in the fact that there is rationale behind every unfolding event. The Divine urges you to bear three cardinal tenets in mind today. Maintain unwavering faith, for it shall shepherd you through these turbulent times and mend the ruptures. Comprehend that Divine intervention is already underway on your behalf poised to transmute every dire circumstance into a fortuitous one. Bestow blessings upon you and your cherished ones, and assuage your tribulations. Whenever you perceive your endurance waning, the Divine shall furnish you with the requisite fortitude. In moments of despondency, joy shall be reinstated in your existence. Amidst apparent impasses, guidance shall be unveiled. The Divine absolves every lapse, rectifies the aftermath of each setback, offers a fresh commencement following every setback, and aids in your convalescence from every setback. What has been promised to you shall remain inviolate. The forthcoming month is poised to be replete with myriad opportunities and copious blessings. Place your trust in me, 
For I am the divine artisan who transforms the implausible into the conceivable and wields the power to metamorphose lives with but a touch. In times of adversity, cling steadfastly to my pledges. Like this video if you believe in God. My love for you is steadfast, and my capacity to shield you knows no bounds. Also, repose faith in my celestial safeguard, for I am the luminary that dispels darkness and meets out justice to those who harbor ill intent. Each passing day, I rejuvenate facets of your life that appear to have ebbed away. Your aspirations, relationships, health, financial circumstances, and felicity are being rejuvenated through Jesus. I apprehend your apprehensions regarding finances, health, and familial bonds. Yet remember, I am perpetually working in your favor. Today, I shall bestow upon you serenity, convalescence, and triumph. Prepare yourself for the blessings that shall transmute your existence. Your period of affliction has drawn to a close. Your faith has remained resolute even amidst the direst of circumstances. Owing to your steadfast faith, I am poised to bless, favor, and heal you. You are on the cusp of embarking upon a phase replete with emancipation, prosperity, and abundance. Affirm my typing, 1919. The Divine enjoins you to vocalize aloud. In 2024, the Divine shall bestow blessings upon me, heal me, provide for me, shield me, and shepherd me. My cherished progeny, I am the progenitor of all that is visible, the firmament, the terra firma, the aqueous expanse, the pinnacles, the solar orb, and the astral realms. I am ever-present, proffering guidance, solace, and protection. Recognize that you occupy a special niche in my heart, and I harbor boundless affection for you. Wondrous occurrences are hurtling toward you, sans conditions, and stand poised to infuse your existence with marvels. You are on the verge of being inundated with a profusion of opulence, affection, and felicity beyond your imaginings. Fret not over anything, instead, in every juncture, through supplication and thanksgiving, articulate your desires to the divine. I herald extraordinary breakthroughs and inconceivable blessings over your life. Cognizant that with you at my side, nothing is beyond reach. In Jesus' appellation, I shall mend and convalesce you, as I have done four times. Your life is poised for a comprehensive transfiguration in every facet. Even when the impasse appears insurmountable, recollect with me, Nothing lies beyond the purview. I am the divine progenitor of marvel. Redemption beckons all who avow fealty to Jesus as sovereign and embrace the conviction that I resurrected him from the abyss. Repose trust in your heart and profess with your tongue to accept my proffered boon of redemption gratuitously. Affirm by typing 20201. The divine heralds, ready yourself for even grander blessings and fresh epiphanies, even amid the maelstrom. Remember that the divine reins are firmly grasped, and your destiny is securely ensconced within divine palms. Your supplication shall be heeded when the hour is propitious. Doors shall unfurl at the optimal moments, and you shall encounter the individuals indispensable to your trajectory. Supported in your evolution and escorted through any predicament you confront, even when the odds appear insurmountable, a stew of despair, a luminary awaits you at the tunnel's terminus. The Divine is poised to assert His presence, not solely to shepherd you toward your destiny, but also to evince to those around you His benediction. Something extraordinary and unprecedented is about to unfold, attesting unequivocally to His favor upon you. In all things, cultivate gratitude, for this is the Divine behest for you in Christ Jesus. 1 Thessalonians 5.18 Today marks the culmination of your days ensconced in agony, angst, and exasperation. The Divine confers upon you deliverance from addiction, despondency, and lamentation. Always remember, the Divine takes cognizance of your tears, hears your entreaties, and stands prepared to deliver you. 
Your appellation is reverberating in locales you have yet to traverse. I am poised to orchestrate marvels in your existence. This month, the cosmos is aligning in your favor, and you are on the brink of receiving all that you have wished, hoped, and prayed for. I extend my blessings to myriad souls, and when life burgeons with prosperity, they often forget me. Please do not forsake me, remain pro, and I desire for you to maintain communion with me. Esteem not lies beyond the purview. I am the divine progenitor of marvel. Redemption beckons all who avow fealty to Jesus as sovereign and embrace the conviction that I resurrected him from the abyss. Repose trust in your heart and profess with your tongue to accept my proffered boon of redemption gratuitously. Affirm by typing 20201. The divine heralds, ready yourself for even grander blessings and fresh epiphanies. Even amid the maelstrom, remember that the divine reins are firmly grasped and your destiny is securely ensconced within divine palms. Your supplication shall be heeded when the hour is propitious. Doors shall unfurl at the optimal moments and you shall encounter the individuals indispensable to your trajectory. Supported in your evolution and escorted through any predicament you confront, even when the odds appear insurmountable, a stew of despair a luminary awaits you at the tunnel's terminus. The Divine is poised to assert His presence, not solely to shepherd you toward your destiny, but also to evince to those around you His benediction. Something extraordinary and unprecedented is about to unfold, attesting unequivocally to His favor upon you. In all things, cultivate gratitude, for this is the Divine behest for you in Christ Jesus. 1 Thessalonians 5.18 Today marks the culmination of your days ensconced in agony, angst, and exasperation. The divine confers upon you deliverance from addiction, despondency, and lamentation. Always remember, the divine takes cognizance of your tears, hears your entreaties, and stands prepared to deliver you. Your appellation is reverberating in locales you have yet to traverse. I am poised to orchestrate marvels in your existence. This month, the cosmos is aligning in your favor, and you are on the brink of receiving all that you have wished, hoped, and prayed for. I extend my blessings to myriad souls, and when life burgeons with prosperity, they often forget me. Please do not forsake me, remain pro, and I desire for you to maintain communion with me. Esteem not the transient aid of medics, legal practitioners, and soldiers, for only I can bestow eternal life. Ever seek me, and I shall guide you toward everlasting elation and serenity. Remember that agony is transient, but joy endures eternally. For every moment of disillusionment, I have something extraordinary and transformative awaiting you. Your heart shall brim with happiness, love, and purpose. Soon, you shall be replete with laughter and receiving joyous tidings. I declare that the remainder of this week shall be resplendent for you. It is certain that the Divine shall bestow upon you convalescence, wealth, novel opportunities, and blessings. Affirm by typing 222 if you believe. Jesus declares, I am your constant companion, ensuring your safety wherever your journey takes you. I shall not depart until every vow I've made to you is fulfilled. God reigns supreme as the Sovereign of Sovereigns and the Monarch of Monarchs, unrivaled in power and authority, reigning over all, rather than succumbing to worry. Transform your anxieties into expressions of praise, and this month shall overflow with glad tidings, answered supplications, breakthroughs, miracles, and favor. This year, God elevates you to a higher plane of existence, replacing your sorrows with joy, your adversity with blessings, and your setbacks with miracles. Place your trust in me and strive forward boldly. Witness the materialization of your desires, that occupation, that relationship, that existence you yearn for. Jesus once imparted these profound words, I am the way, the truth, and the life. What your heart seeks is found in me. 
Do not waste any more time. Do not heed the world's distractions. Follow my teachings. Delve into the scriptures. Raise the sword of faith. And dawn yourself in my armor. You deserve happiness. You deserve a life filled with joy and prosperity. I have seen the pain you carry. And I understand. You trusted blindly and were betrayed. They turned their backs on you. But today, I extend my hand to you. I want you to hear this message of salvation I have for your life. The path of the righteous is challenging, but I am present in every step. No righteous person is forsaken, nor do their descendants beg for bread. Your soul is nourished and rejuvenated each time you hear my voice. Your spirit is revitalized by the waters of my spring. I lift you from despondency and despair, trials, struggles, and pain can weigh heavily. But in the light of my word, you will always find freedom. You need not carry your burdens alone. Let me bear what weighs upon your shoulders. I did not create you to live in suffering. I did not call you to be a child of sorrow. The obstacles in your path are lessons that will make you wiser. Embrace each challenge as an opportunity to grow in prudence. You can view your problems as lessons or as defeats. Focus on following the guidance of my word. Study Proverbs within my holy scriptures. You will find what you seek. I want these words to resonate deeply within your heart. Hear me once more with all the love I have. I have entered this world so that each soul may lead a life brimming with joy and abundance, to a degree where their felicity knows no bounds. This declaration serves as a gentle reminder of God's desire for all to live their lives to the fullest. He longs for us to be enveloped in joy, love, and harmonious relationships with others. The auspicious news is that you stand on the cusp of entering a phase replete with these sublime experiences. There exist blessings of affection, vitality, and opulence making their way to you. Should tears cascade down your countenance upon encountering this missive, recognize that God extends His hand to you, especially in your moments of anguish. This message finds you for a reason. God intends to convey that He is currently paving a path for you. He stands ready to alleviate your physical afflictions, bestow upon you remarkable opportunities, and mend any strained relationships. Maintain your faith, for the epic of significant positive transformation looms large. May God's tranquility, surpassing human understanding, shield your heart and mind through Christ Jesus. Embrace the abundance of His love and benevolence, and let your life serve as a testament to His kindness and fidelity. God has chosen to shield you from those who seek to inflict financial harm upon you. If you remain steadfast in your faith, I implore you to share this video with seven individuals. Like, share, and do not overlook the significance of subscribing to the channel for blessings to unfurl. My cherished one, I am poised to shower you with an endless cascade of blessings radiant smiles, financial prosperity, and improved health. Furthermore, I shall impart healing and rejuvenation to both your corporeal and mental being, allowing you to bask in a profound sense of tranquility and security. This week, God is poised to triple the blessings in your life. You shall serve as a living testament to the boundless possibilities when God takes residence in your life and His miracles become manifest realities. God is cognizant of your needs even before they escape your lips. Therefore, may God satisfy all your needs in the name of Jesus. God is lifting the burdens from your existence. He is transmuting your life from one of tribulation and scarcity to one of healing, solace, and abundance. My child, remember, it is I who bestows upon you advancements and blessings. What I have pledged to you cannot be wrested away by anyone, and I am ever at your side. Understand that salvation is within reach for all who openly profess Jesus as Lord and genuinely believe that I raised Him from the dead. Believe fervently and openly profess your faith to accept my gift of salvation unreservedly. You may encounter sundry challenges, be it illness, adversaries, or other trials, yet I surpass any obstacle you may face in might. I am mightier than any impediment you encounter. 
and I shall forge a path for you. Therefore, nurture hope and repose your trust in me to navigate you through. Surrender all worries, fears, anxieties, and pain, and welcome my tranquility, love, healing, and blessings. I declare that you shall receive uplifting news regarding something you have patiently awaited as I orchestrate circumstances in your favor. Thus, brace yourself for an unforeseen breakthrough and a miracle that shall alter the trajectory of your life imminently. The Lord has vowed to perpetually accompany you, contending with your adversaries and quelling every tempest you confront. His peace and joy shall permeate your existence. He has already charted your course into the future. Express gratitude for the blessings He has already bestowed upon you. He shall guide you along a splendid path, and you shall stride forth in triumph. Believe in yourself and have faith in God's blueprint for your existence. Acknowledge that every trial and tribulation you encounter serves a purpose. Trust in His timing, for He discerns what is optimal for you. Maintain an optimistic outlook and refuse to yield to negative ruminations. Recall, God transcends any predicament you may encounter. Whatever you have beseeched, believe it has already been granted unto you, and it shall be yours. Nevertheless, when you pray, you must believe and harbor no doubt, for doubt is akin to a wave upon the sea, swayed and tossed by the wind. Place your faith in God's assurances and apprehend that He has mapped out your destiny. His affection for you is unwavering and eternal. Type 555 to lay claim to it. The Lord asserts, Today, prayer shall guide you to the right destination, the right individuals, and the right opportunities. Commence your supplications, and you shall commence witnessing triumphs. Jesus articulated, You may presently be enveloped in sorrow, but I shall meet you again, and your heart shall overflow with joy, a joy no one can wrest from you. John 16, 22. God is in the process of metamorphosing your circumstances for the better. He shall bless you and your kinfolk. He shall mend every facet of your life that festers in agony. Suddenly, you shall encounter kindred spirits. Your health shall ameliorate. Doors hitherto sealed shall swing open, and your entreaties shall be answered. The blessings that God has prepared for you and your family transcend anything ever witnessed, heard, or envisaged. Should you persevere in watching this discourse until its conclusion, the arduous days of financial, emotional, and physical trials shall draw to a close, and you shall usher in the most resplendent days of your existence. Even as you feel weighed down by financial obligations presently, God is poised to bestow upon you a financial windfall. Embrace it with faith and accept it with gratitude. While physicians preserve your corporeal existence, legal counselors safeguard your rights, and soldiers ensure your security, solely God possesses the power to grant you an existence that endures eternally. Bear in mind always, only God has the ability to transmute a quandary into a proclamation, a trial into a testament, a tribulation into a triumph, and a casualty into a conqueror. This month, God shall drench you in unending blessings heightened felicity, financial prosperity, and augmented health. This night marks the cessation of your tears, anxieties, and distress. God shall reinstate the opportunities and time you have squandered. He is poised to grace you with a life overflowing with abundance, robust health, joy, and felicity. If you are perusing these words, fret not. Financial resources shall gravitate towards you. You shall surmount all adversities. Love shall permeate your life, and circumstances shall vastly improve beyond your wildest imaginings. All sources of past sorrow shall dissipate, supplanted by joy, laughter, love, and blessings. May this month be one of healing, transformation, blessings, and accomplishments. I shall carve a path for you. I have done so before, and I shall do so again. God is tending to your wounds and revitalizing your financial status. God is steering you into the most gratifying season of your life. This week, 
I shall triple the financial blessings you receive. Type 777 to embrace it. Divine messages beckon you to open the chambers of your heart to welcome a surge of amplified favor. Believe in the divine prowess capable of transmuting your darkest nights into resplendent morns. Every adverse pattern in your journey is being shattered by the benevolence of the divine. You stand at the threshold of a new epoch adorned with emancipation, opulence, and profusion. Beneath the protective aegis of the divine, you shall find a sanctuary to seek refuge. The divine fidelity shall serve as an impregnable fortress and shield around you, endowing you with the valor and fortitude to confront adversities with celestial beings as your allies. Rest assured that the machinations of your adversaries shall be thwarted. The Almighty ensures that those who take delight in the divine remain unwavering, even if they stumble. They shall not falter, for the divine upholds them with divine grace. Prepare yourself for the advent of prosperity, robust health, and fortified relationships. Entrust your entire being to the divine and witness the orchestration of miracles in your life. I declare the endowment of affliction. Your well-being shall flourish, and your financial landscape shall thrive. In this present week, when all else fades, leaving nothing but the divine, behold unforeseen miracles that transmute existence eternally. I am present to unlock gates long sealed, and you shall witness miracles unfolding in your existence. My beloved, permit me to mend your fractures and restore you. Your vision shall garner unwavering support. Every impediment shall dissipate, and you shall achieve triumph beyond the realms of imagination. Remember to place your unwavering trust in the divine with every fiber of your being, and not solely rely on your cognitive faculties. Acknowledge the divine in every facet of existence, and divine guidance shall pave your path to triumph. In moments of despondency, I am here to supplant your grief with elation and your agitation with serenity. Simply beckon unto me, and I shall hasten to your aid. Whatsoever you have beseeched for, believe that it has been granted unto you, and it shall manifest. When you supplicate, let doubt find no dwelling within you. For doubt is akin to a wave upon the sea, swayed and tossed by the wind. Rest upon the promises of the divine for your life. A grand design is ordained, and the divine's love for you knows no bounds, eternal and boundless. Respond with 999 to affirm. The divine speaks. Let us entreat together for the abundant blessings of the divine to inundate your existence. Sovereign, envelop me, my companions, and my kin with the precious holy blood of the divine Son, Jesus Christ. Bless and safeguard all those who seek and necessitate you in times of travail. Super Parent, we implore your providence and counsel as we embark upon this era of bounty. Dispatch celestial emissaries to safeguard and vigil over us as we fulfill the divine mandate for our lives. Instill within us faith in your covenant and conviction that you shall bestow upon us boundless blessings. We beseech this in the appellation of Jesus Christ. The divine addresses you today. Your life stands on the precipice of transformation. And the divine shall assuage your distress, apprehensions, and tribulations of, replacing them with robust well-being, felicity, and tranquility. Brace yourself for the advent of substantial alterations in your vocation, financial status, health, and bonds. The divine vows to enshroud you with blessings beyond fathomable comprehension. In the forthcoming days, anticipate with eagerness the ingress of wondrous miracles into your life. May you be bestowed with opulence, vitality, joy, and metamorphosis illuminating your trajectory and guiding you toward the life preordained for you. The Divine's intent is to bestow blessings upon you and your lineage, poised to assuage any anguish you bear. Recall, when you place your faith in the Divine, hope is ever-present. You are never bereft, for the Divine perpetually watches over you, your sentinel receptive to your entreaties. I am the Sovereign of Heaven's hosts, and nothing eludes my dominion. I reign over diurnal and nocturnal realms alike, and I tread upon the loftiest summits. I provide sustenance and satiety to those who seek me. 
I tender eternal life, boundless jubilation, and complete felicity. I dispatch a current of affection, restoration, and abundance that you rightfully merit. Your lineage shall be restored, and miracles shall manifest precisely when needed, all in the potent appellation of Jesus. I shall soon bestow upon you tokens that shall inundate your life with jubilance, mirth, and affluence. Open your heart to receive that which I have ordained for you. The divine is dispelling the adversities from your life. Benevolent occurrences such as love and pecuniary blessings are en route to you, and you shall experience a felicity unparalleled. Envision me as the provider who inundates your life with abundance and safeguards your wealth from harm. I aspire for every affliction, every source of consternation, and every squander you encounter to be alleviated. Instead, may you find yourself ensconced in robust health, unending joy, and a tranquility so profound it defies articulation. At this moment, I dispatch bespoke gifts to you, miracles, blessings, and transformative occurrences solely for you. Place your trust in me, for you are cherished and invaluable. Even amidst the direst straits, you are not solitary. I stand beside you, furnishing you with the fortitude and succor you require. Know this, my cherished one. I am diligently laboring to reinstate the opportunities and instants you deemed lost. I am ushering into your life a plethora of auspicious occurrences, vitality, joy, and felicity. The grief, consternation, and burdens you have borne are on the cusp of being alleviated. This evening heralds the cessation of those tribulations. By week's end, your life shall be bedecked with blessings, leaving no space for distress or quandaries. I have marvelous surprises in store for you. Prepare yourself for a deluge of extraordinary experiences. The anxiety and sleeplessness that have dogged you shall imminently dissipate. Respond with 1010 to claim it. Jesus speaks. This entire week is designated for miracles crafted exclusively for you. Each day from Monday to Sunday shall unveil something extraordinary in every facet of your life, suffusing it with jubilation, affluence, and tranquility hitherto unbeknown to you. Your fiscal circumstances shall ameliorate, your personal bonds shall fortify, and your well-being shall be imbued with vigor. Your welfare shall be touched by a miraculous agency, transfiguring your existence with blessings. Boundless occurrences lie on the horizon, including triumph, felicity, robust health, and enduring relationships. Prepare your heart to receive them with faith and gratitude. May this week unfold in manners that draw you nearer to your aspirations. Unlatching doors and presenting resolutions to your current dilemmas. Um, regardless of the obstacles you encounter, remember, I stand beside you and waging alongside you, ensuring your triumph. The adversary has long been vanquished, ensuring that no harm or weapon shall ever reach you. When tribulations arise, I shall answer your supplications for succor and safeguard you. A surprise awaits you. I have orchestrated your healing, elevation, emancipation, and bliss. In companionship, I have stood by you in your darkest moments and extended aid when you needed it most. I have never faltered in my support, and I never shall. You are of paramount importance to me, and my affection for you is boundless. Bliss, restoration, and triumph are en route to you, not owing to your deeds, but through divine grace. My affection for you is boundless and unconditional, hence, relinquish your concerns, apprehensions, and misgivings. Trust in the trajectory of your life, cognizant that I am in command, the progenitor of miracles and the guardian of your essence. I have witnessed your tears and discerned the burdens you have borne. Now it is time for you to receive abundance. I am here to provision, heal, and kindle hope. My aspiration is to equip you with every requisite to fulfill your purpose and lead a life replete with abundance. While the roles of physicians and jurists and warriors are indispensable, 
solely I can proffer eternal life. Seek me above all and discover genuine contentment with me. The unattainable becomes attainable. I derive pleasure in blessing you with jubilation, fiscal expansion, and enhanced well-being. My son Jesus is the fountain of spiritual nourishment. Unfasten your heart to him, and you shall discover a contentment enduring. Believe in my covenant and embrace the blessings forthcoming. I am with you, guiding each stride you take. I am the one who fortifies you, heals your infirmities, and restores the affection and serenity you have yearned for. Abundance is en route to you effortlessly and sans struggle. Prepare for an extraordinary week teeming with healing, opulence, and unforeseen opportunities. You stand on the brink of experiencing an inundation of blessings. Respond with 1111 to receive it. The Almighty proclaims as your invincible guardian, I perpetually stand at the ready, prepared to shield and navigate you through even the most formidable adversities. Should you find yourself adrift, seek solace in me. I shall console and steer you. This forthcoming month, anticipate blessings that shall undoubtedly bring forth a smile. Brace yourself for financial breakthroughs and unparalleled opportunities unlike any encountered before. Bear in mind these four quintessential aspects concerning my divine nature. Firstly, I shall ingeniously chart a course for you through any obstacle. Secondly, I fervently champion your cause, ensuring you are never alone. Simply place your trust in me. Thirdly, your entreaties hold considerable sway. When overwhelmed, reach out to me, and I shall extend solace. And fourthly, repose trust in my divine timing. I discern what is optimal for you and when it is ripe for fruition. Rest assured, this ensuing week shall be replete with tailor-made miracles crafted solely for you. From the dawn to the dusk of the week, anticipate enhancements in your financial standing, relationships, and well-being. I'm diligently orchestrating a substantial metamorphosis in your life. As you relinquish your anxieties, I shall suffuse your heart with jubilation. I am transitioning you from destitution to abundance. Miracles, boons, and constructive changes are en route to facilitate your ascendancy in every sphere of existence. Be prepared for delightful surprises, healing, emancipation, opulence, and vitality. Respond with 1515 if you find this resonant. The divine decree proclaims the dissolution of all preceding anguish thereby clearing the path for an epical triumph. The forthcoming week heralds the advent of extraordinary marvels, momentous advancements, and even loftier endowments. Anticipate an unexpected amelioration across your occupational pursuits, financial endeavors, physical well-being, and interpersonal bonds. During the impending weekend, brace yourself for prodigious wonders for I intend to elevate you to unprecedented pinnacles within your lineage. With my presence as your constant companion, the insurmountable transmutes into the attainable. I forge pathways in the most unforeseen of domains. My cherished comprehend that every benevolent bestowal emanates from my divine essence. That which I pledge unto you remains impervious to usurpation, cessation, or obliteration. Rather than succumbing to apprehension, incline toward supplication. And this lunar cycle shall be replete with felicitous tidings, prayers answered, dilemmas resolved, serendipitous events, and augmented tenderness from your peers. This annal signifies a pivotal juncture towards a more felicitous existence. You shall taste jubilation in lieu of tribulation, bounties instead of deprivations, and prodigies rather than disillusionments. It marks a period of pecuniary opulence, perpetual tranquility, and timely succor. For my divine providence, I perpetually stand sentinel, ensuring your security and welfare. My intent is to furnish you with vitality, opulence, and rectitude, thereby empowering you to succor others. The Annunciation of Jesus is unequivocal. Live in devotion to Him, not in self-service. 
He shall fortify your faith amidst adversities and illuminate your path when obscurity prevails. Let us offer gratitude to the Almighty, the progenitor of Jesus, who sustains us amid our adversities. Recall, I am a benevolent deity, perpetually accessible to you, proficient in the accomplishment of the ineffable. Place your trust in me, and behold as the tapestry of your life unfurls in extraordinary patterns. Aspire for your pecuniary fortunes to soar, ensuring a superabundance beyond your needs. Yearn for your flourishing in liberty and affluence. Propitious occurrences loom on the horizon, encompassing fiscal amelioration, convalescence of health, and timely prodigies. The Divine has pledged that imminently He shall endow us in manners beyond our conception. It is opportune to exalt in anticipation and prepare for the miraculous interventions He is poised to orchestrate within our lives. This eve signifies the cessation of your tears, trepidations, and burdens. The Divine is poised to intervene and reinstate equilibrium. He shall reinstate forfeited opportunities and recapture fleeting time. Our lives shall be inundated with abundance, robust health, elation, and felicity. Vocalize and internalize the affirmation. I am primed for an inundation of love, convalescence, and abundance befitting my merit. I harbor unwavering faith in the Divine's capacity to restore the well-being of my kinfolk and myself. I am confident that prodigies shall find us at the precise juncture of necessity. This destiny, there looms a splendid occasion on the horizon, one that shall revolutionize your existence for the better. Your financial woes shall swiftly ameliorate, affording you the capacity to settle your debts and discharge your obligations. Sans trepidation, surrender all your anxieties, apprehensions, and misgivings unto the divine providence. Beseech him for fortitude, enlightenment, and perspicacity. The Almighty imparts unto you the assurance that he already attends to your needs. He shall transmute adversities into boons, bestow blessings upon you and your beloved kin, and assuage any anguish you may endure. Bear in mind, the Almighty contends on your behalf. Whenever you find yourself besieged, fearful, or impotent, recognize that the Almighty is your shield, waging your battles. You traverse this path not alone. Repose trust in the omnipotence of God, and remember his perpetual companionship, never forsaking you. By yielding ourselves unto the divine will, he graces us and our progeny, enhancing our existence. He alleviates our suffering and transforms our defeats into triumphs, as the scripture claims. At the appointed hour, I, the Lord, shall bring it to pass, as your fortunes commence their metamorphosis, reflect upon the benevolence and solace of the divine. He transmutes your sorrow into joy and directs you towards prosperity and opulence, even amidst frailty. Bear in mind that God is your sustenance. I affirm the invocation for healing in this moment. I implore for the protection of Jesus over myself and all that is of import to me. God discerns us intimately and disdains our afflictions. He comprehends our tribulations and yearns to alleviate them. His love for us is boundless. Permit him to assuage our anguish and mend the scars of yesterday. He shall reinstate what has been forfeited and endow us with the requisites for flourishing. Prepare thyself for splendid occurrences this weekend. Unseal your heart to the munificence of divine blessings and brace for a life replete with felicity, prosperity, and fulfillment. God labors in your favor, showering blessings upon you and your kindred, and assuaging all your sorrows. He shall treble your blessings this week, confounding the skeptics and infusing your life with zest. Comprehend this. God is capable of the inconceivable. Place your trust in Him and behold the marvels He shall orchestrate in your life. Remember, He reigns supreme over all, including your destiny. Over the ensuing days, God shall unveil His omnipotence in manners hitherto unseen, you shall bear witness to remarkable breakthroughs and blessings that shall overflow into your life. God possesses the capacity to transmute stress and chaos into splendorous manifestations, imparting solace when most needed. 
merely repose trust in his timing, he ceaselessly endeavors to usher goodness into our lives. Affirm with 2222. God avers. Irrespective of the challenges that assail you, bear in mind that God stands as your ally. He shall transmute your tribulations into triumphs, ensuring that goodness cascades upon you and those dear to your heart. He shall also bestow healing upon the afflicted. In 2024, anticipate a year of recuperation and evolution. God shall restore your vitality, mend your relations, and rectify your fiscal standing. Let us entreat together, expressing gratitude for the blessings that approach. We repose trust in His designs for our future. We pledge ourselves to be instruments of beneficence, employing our time, uh, talents, and resources to aid others in their ascent to success and to exalt the name of God. This year, we shall relish greater affluence, uh, enhanced well-being, ceaseless elation, unforeseen benedictions, and genuine affection. We stand enriched by myriad blessings that engender joy and financial ascendancy. Promotions and blessings emanate from God. Let us fortify our faith and anticipate His continued miracles and benison. Your fiscal standing is poised to ameliorate. Healing shall permeate your existence, and miracles shall manifest. The months of May and August shall usher abundance, blessings, and innumerable prospects. Brace yourself for the extraordinary, for God is poised to effect wondrous occurrences in your life. Your miracle draws nigh, impervious to hindrance. God shall chart a course where none seems feasible. In the name of Jesus, I pronounce favor, benevolence, and benedictions upon you. Success, opulence, and robust health shall grace your path. Place unwavering trust in God's blueprint for you and maintain faith that He shall never forsake you. The forthcoming week burgeons with miracles, auspicious tidings, breakthroughs, and yet more blessings. Recall the parable of the ten lepers healed by Jesus. The one who returned to express gratitude was told, Your faith has made you whole. This imparts the potency of gratitude amidst adversity. Cultivate prayer. It is imperative to commune with God not solely in times of distress. Your fiscal burdens shall be alleviated, and you shall prosper. You shall possess an abundance, enabling you to save a life, embark on voyages, and pursue your aspirations. Christ has already triumphed, and through prayer, God shall effect the requisite changes and aid you in reconciling with your losses. Under His guidance, you shall discern the resplendent future that awaits. Faith is indispensable to elicit divine favor. We must trust in His existence and believe that He rewards those who earnestly seek Him. When beseeching God, harbor faith and esteem. Your past adversities shall diminish as God's love and grace suffuse your life. Jesus pledges eternal life to those who embrace Him with faith. As minuscule as a mustard seed, you can displace mountains. Believe in the omnipresence of God's blessings, even when imperceptible, and you shall find solace and tranquility. God harbors innumerable blessings for us. He yearns to bestow them upon us. But we must remain receptive. With faith and trust in God, we shall witness miracles this year. Believe in the miracles that surround you and acknowledge that God accompanies you at every turn. Affirm with five, 555. Jesus imparts wisdom, continue progressing, and divine blessings shall bestow upon you tranquility, restoration, and triumph. From the ashes, God shall craft beauty. Every blessing emanates from the divine, and His assurances shall indeed manifest. Transform your anxieties into acts of reverence this month, and it shall be replete with felicitous tidings, prayers met, breakthroughs, and serendipity. This year, the divine shall elevate your existence, ushering forth felicity, bounties, and marvels. The divine desires your felicity, adoration, and benediction. His beneficence toward you shall extend to your progeny and their progeny. He vows perpetual guardianship, contending your battles and infusing tranquility into your journey. An expanse of elation and serenity awaits. 
The Divine is orchestrating a magnificent resurgence for you. Celestial beings assist, prayers are heeded, and financial succor approaches. You are embarking upon an epic of divine favor and miracles. Notwithstanding past tribulations, divine providence shall shield you from harm. He intends to grace you with vigor, affluence, and the capacity to aid others. Jesus urges us to entrust in Him and live in His essence. Fear shall be supplanted by faith, and He shall shepherd us through adversity. May opulence, vitality, jubilation, and metamorphosis fill you abundantly. Let these benedictions illuminate your path, guiding you toward your ordained destiny. The Divine pledges to drench us in unimaginable jubilation in the impending days. Prepare to welcome these prodigious marvels into your sphere. When confronted with trials, do not relinquish hope. Surrender your worries unto the Divine, and He shall navigate you through every tribulation, proffer solutions, and serenity. Trust in His Divine scheme, for He shall lead you to victory. As a compassionate patriarch watches over his progeny, the Divine watches over us with boundless love and shelter. As adherents, we are graced with the Holy Spirit's solace and fortification. If despondency looms, supplicate unto Jesus. Recall, the Divine surpasses all adversities, transcending our anxieties, anguish, and apprehensions. The imminent week is replete with promises of jubilation, indelible moments, connections, benedictions, and outcomes surpassing our anticipation. As we surrender our anxieties and uncertainties unto the Divine, He fortifies us, bestows guidance, and imparts clarity and foresight for the future. Prayer forges connections with auspicious realms, individuals, and opportunities. Embrace prayer, and triumph shall ensue. In the ensuing six months, you shall find yourself amidst your coveted automobile, outside your newfound abode, and endowed with a substantial pecuniary reservoir. Remember, the Divine abides with you through every vicissitude, in moments propitious and adverse. Irrespective of your travails, He stands alongside you. As your fiscal circumstances ameliorate, so shall your familial ties and relationships. I pronounce these verbiages in Jesus' appellation, and they shall materialize. Today, I impart unto you tranquility, restoration, and triumph. You are on the cusp of a resplendent season where all shall align harmoniously for you. Enter 7, 770 if you maintain belief. Jesus asserts, let us offer supplication in unison. Beloved Jesus, you are my stalwart. I beseech your healing for myself, my kin, and my confidant. I place complete trust in you. Today, I'm receptive to receiving love, restoration, and the blessings befitting me. Wholeness shall be bestowed upon my entire kin, and miracles shall manifest in moments of dire need. You stand on the verge of a season teeming with miracles and transformative blessings. The divine shall fortify your well-being mend interpersonal bonds, and invigorate your finances. When we devote ourselves unto the Divine, He enriches not only our existence but that of our kin. He assuages all our afflictions and transmutes our defeats into extraordinary triumphs. This year, we shall witness an abundance of blessings in our financial realms. In the days ahead, profound elation shall envelop you obliterating any vestige of sorrow. For the Divine is poised to significantly enhance your existence. He shall endow blessings upon you and your cherished ones, ushering forth felicity and love into your lives. The blessings forthcoming shall be manifold and life-altering. The Divine has decreed that in May 2024, He shall grace you and your lineage with opulence and plenty and enfold you within His angelic guardianship. In the imminent future, He intends to shower upon you gifts that shall evoke jubilation, mirth, and prosperity. Remain open to embracing the bounty and prosperity the cosmos stands prepared to bestow upon you. The Divine's perpetual blessings shall encompass healing, affection, 
and affluence. You are on the brink of a transformative event that shall engender greater joy than hitherto experienced. He prepares to dispatch unto you extraordinary manifestations such as miracles, blessings, and enhancements to ensure your success and flourishing across all facets of life. Furthermore, He shall bestow upon you a life replete with positivity, encompassing wealth, robust health, unbridled joy, and unceasing felicity. This juncture is yours to relish in well-being, jubilation, uh, and triumph. Financial abundance shall effortlessly gravitate towards you, leaving you astounded by the plenitude resultant from the Divine's munificence. By week's end, your existence shall teem with blessings, emancipating you from apprehensions. It is proclaimed in Jesus' appellation that no calamity or adversity shall prevail over you, your health, your time, your finances, and your cherished ones. The disquietude presently ensnaring you shall shortly dissipate, and your woes shall be supplanted for a transformative miracle hastens toward you. You walk, occupy a sacred abode cherished without reservation. Its purpose is to enrich you spiritually and financially and revitalize your health, fiscal state, and relationships. In Jesus' appellation, He traversed so that you might experience tranquility and revel in a life of opulence to its zenith until it overflows to all who encounter these words. Receive tranquility and a profusion of divine favor in Jesus' appellation. You are stepping into a period of vast abundance and unwavering love. Grand designs are ordained for your future. In the near future, you shall be endowed with a life brimming with mirth, merit, and considerable opulence. The year 2024 shall mark a remarkable convalescence for you. Good health shall be attained, affirmative relationships cultivated, and financial equilibrium relished. This year shall herald fiscal independence, enhanced well-being, and the discovery of genuine affection. Enter Amen if this proclamation resonates within you. My child, subscribe to the channel now. Share this video with your five contacts.